Roger, Sam. Roger. Up. Morning, sir. Captain Jampel said you wanted to see me. That's right, Lieutenant. I've got a recon job for you. See this bridge here? Yes, sir. When the battalion moves forward tomorrow morning, that bridge is going to be on our flank. I want your platoon to knock it out before the attack begins and make it tough on the crowds. Well, that's a demolition job, sir. I thought you said it was recon. I did. The terrain around that bridge is rough. I want you to pick out the best way in beforehand, from the air. You must be kidding, Colonel. That plate's not an airplane. I tell you, Colonel, I've seen better looking kites. Lieutenant Brannigan reporting, sir. I hope we didn't get in your way, Lieutenant. The kite you're referring to, Lieutenant? happens to be a U.S. Army liaison on observation aircraft, also known as an L-4. Where's the guy I gotta take up, Colonel? Lieutenant Hanley. Oh. <laughs> you ever have those boondockers off the ground before, Lieutenant? I'm not sure I want them off the ground in that bag of nuts and bolts, Lieutenant. So much for pre-flight. You got any questions on this? No, sir. We pick the easiest approach to the bridge from the air, going on foot tomorrow and blow it. Right, but don't go all the way to the bridge. If you spot it, it'll tip the mission. Yes, sir. Oh, and Hanley, don't let Brannigan bother you. Oh, no more than a summer rash, Colonel. Okay, Grand Pounder, you ready? Good luck, Hanley. At least. So long, Colonel. Hey, Sergeant. Yes, sir. You ever trapped one of these things before? No, sir. Why don't you give it a try? Oh. Well, 
I can see you've never been on the good old single-engine high-wing monoplane before. Lieutenant, let's just get this heap off the ground and do what we've got to do. Right on. Switch on! You look a little green. Relax, enjoy. When I get home. Where you're going? Think you can find the way? I'll try. <laughs> Little turbulence. Yeah. You know, some guys come unglued up here. I can never understand why. I can. <laughs> you know, with me, it's just the opposite. When I'm on the ground, everything gets in my hair. Ooh. Is that wing supposed to flap? Who wants a stiff wing? Ever see a bird? You learn to fly in the army? <laughs> no, no. Town pastures. County fairs, that kind of thing. Flew the mail for a while. Spent a few years up in Alaska, bush pilot. When I joined up, they saw my fight record, they says, Brannigan, the Army Air Corps for you, B-17s. And I says, no thank you. You call that flying? I call that flying a freight train across the sky. I'll drop a wing. What? So you can see better, Lieutenant. When you come back here on foot tomorrow, you and your boys can shimmy right up that ridge. Looks like it ought to be real easy. Too easy. Too exposed. That gully looks better. Lots of cover.
We shouldn't be too far from that bridge. Over the next hill. All right, make tracks for home. Germans around here. That was the picture. Sure would like to find out their strength. Can you get any closer? Follow me. I better call it in the radio working. As soon as we get a little more altitude. Amerikanisches Luftzeug. Anhören. Nehm Deckung. Red Dot. Red Dot. Gas tank. Radio took a slug. Red Dot. It's dead. Not to mention us. Lucky Sue, we gotta find a place to set you down. Soon. If we can make it over those hills, the Germans might not know we're going down.
seid ihr nicht auf eurem Posten. I hear Germans. Yeah. Looks like a small command post of some sort. Tents. Think they saw us come down? I don't think so. Looks like a patrol coming back. They went into the tent. Uh, we sure bought us a peck of trouble. German build up we saw. Yeah. Without the radio, how are we gonna let them know? I'll have to tell them, I guess. <sighs> On foot? You're daydreaming, pal. How far would you say we are inside our lines? Well, we were about six miles in when we saw that German column. And we flew ten more minutes, so that's about. 20 miles as the crow flies, 25 miles on foot. Oh, with any luck, I can make it in seven hours. Yeah, and without luck, you couldn't do it in seven years. That's 25 miles of Germans. You'd be playing hide and seek all day long. But there is another way, Hanley. What? We'll fly out. In that? In that. It should be shot. Put out of its misery. Lucky Sue may be down, but she's not out. You get me enough cloth to fix that aileron, get me one bolt, oh, five sixteenth, I'll fix the landing gear, and then I'll cut some plugs for the gas tank, and you get the gas to put in the tank, and we'll be on our way. You know you're off your rocker. Suppose I could get all this stuff for you. What do you think the crowds are going to be doing? We have to start the engine, taxi out, find a runway. What about that rock wall that's blocking our path? Du, was machst du da oben, Großvater? Je m'en pas. Better get out of here. That old guy is probably in there right now yelling cop.
English? I speak some. Who are you? What are you doing with the Bosch? I am Claude Genet. I bring to the Bosch fresh eggs from my farm. The Bosch is our enemy. For the eggs, they give me the coffee. Oh, how chummy. <laughs> oh, no, 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 monsieur. It's not what you think. I am not a collaborator. Captain Zweiger, the German officer, he said he would destroy my farm if I did not make trade with him. I have no choice. All right, monsieur. We need your help. What would you like me to do? We have to repair our airplane. You didn't fall for that line he gave you, did you? Do we have a choice? We need gasoline, cloth, and a large metal bolt. You will fly off from down there? What do you ask? There is a wall, monsieur. Then we'll have to take part of the wall out. Are you kidding? If the bus sees you out there, school's out. Maybe you can do it. We'll figure out a way so that the Germans don't become suspicious. But after you're not here, they would know I assisted you. They would kill me. If you're here, we'll see that you're not. If I help you, Captain Zweiger will destroy my farm in how you say, retribution. I'm sorry, monsieur, but uh, you can rebuild your farm later. Rebuild, monsieur. I have 75 years of age. There is little time left for me. No. No. I cannot help you. I am too old to be threatened, as well. Are you also too old to think of the young? If I don't get back to my lines with the information I have, a hundred, perhaps a thousand young men will never see 25, let alone 75. I will do what I can to help you. Well, uh, with this leg, I won't be able to use the rudder pedals. So you're going to have to fly it out. That too? What are you making such a big deal for? Anybody can fly a good old... I know. A good old high-wing monoplane. Come on, let's go before I break his other leg. First, monsieur. Canvas. 
a strong cloth, needle, and thread or string to sew it with. This was my wife, Angelic sewing basket. I'm afraid we have no canvas. Make the sheets from the bed. No, I don't think they'd be strong enough. Yeah, maybe these will do. You have any gasoline? Yeah. Petrol. Oh, a sauce. I have no need for essence, monsieur. I have my horse and cart. What do you intend to do, monsieur? I'm not quite sure. Maybe we can use the horse and cart to move the rocks. You are here and that I am helping you. Be quiet. You must run! All right, now take it easy. Settle down. Now, you don't know why he came. Talk to them. Get them all to come inside. But how? I don't know how. I gotta have some time to get some gasoline. Les essais sont mauvais. Mauvais? Mauvais. Entrez, monsieur. Vous êtes vin, monsieur? Non, merci. Il y a des effrayés dans la grange. Gay! Bring fresh air here! No, no, merci. Nous devons conduire à village.
I tried to delay them, but they have to go to the village. What did he want? See, the eggs are bad. I heard that certain weeds and grasses may be responsible. You know what you need, Claude? A new barn to keep your chickens at home. A good strong barn made of rocks. Like the rocks from that wall where the airplane is. You said the Germans just went to the village. And you could have a hole cut through that wall by the time they return. Don't worry, we'll bring it off. Augustin! Je vais bâtir un nouveau poulailler. Appelle-toi Rush, ça se mur. Was sagt der? Ich weiß nicht, ich kann mich verstehen. Der Rush? Der Rush, comme ça? Der Rush, là. Rush? Steine? Oui, oui, le se mur, là. Ah, wird die Steine da oben. Na, bedien dich selbst alle, geh. Und das ist ja harmlos, lass ihn doch. to get us 20 miles? Just barely. If it's high enough octane to get us off the ground. Here's the bolt. Material. Fix the aileron. Hang on thread. Hey, what's the old guy doing with the cart? Gotta cut a path through that rock wall. How's he gonna explain that to the crowds? Tell him he needed rocks for a new barn. I don't think they understood him. What's wrong? What are you waiting for? I'm afraid that Captain Swiker will not believe me when he returns. You'll be done by then. Now, after you finish loading the rocks, head for the next village, all right? I am not very brave, yeah, monsieur. You're doing just fine. Design. I thought it would give the old crates some class. <laughs> you know, the first lucky suit. I had her painted Tilly Green. The first lucky suit? Yeah. You mean there were others? Sure, two. What happened to them? Never mind. I'd rather not know. Der alte Mann. Er will Steine, Herr Hauptmann. Steine? Für was? 
Wir können ihn nicht verstehen, Herr Hauptmann. Was? Bring ihn. Es wird mir leid, Herr Hauptmann. Hey, Lieutenant. Yeah. Lift up the wing, will you? So I can get this bolt in. Komm schon! In der Rost ist schon da passiert? Komm zum Herrn Hartmann. Er hat Verlangen nach dir. Komm! Okay, don't let it down easy. Good. Ah! You okay? Oh, I'm fine. It only hurts when I fall flat on my face. Give me a hand, will you? Hey, why don't you sit over there and let me do the work? Je vais bâtir un nouveau poulailler avec la roche de ce mur. Vous avez besoin d'aide. Allez, rascomme Oh, you 
old man, he's got the crowd pulling the wall down for him. <laughs> How'd he pull that? I don't know. Let's get this crate ready to roll when he gives us the runway. Hey, where do I put this or do I drink it for courage? Oh, no. Gas cap's right up there. The funnel's in the front cockpit. Doug, where's that broker? The broker is verschwunden. The muscle car. The muscle car. for like. Gas gets us off the ground. Switch on. Switch on. Thank you. 